I find joy in opening up the doors wide open, getting plenty of fresh air within the house. Summer months do fill me up with energy to be active. And a big ground of cleaning and organizing the house is a lot easy now. I have made up my mind in organizing this little storage space, kind of a closet which is hardly used as there's no proper shelving with a big open space more to dump than to keep things organized. I have made up my mind to utilize this space in the best way that I can from now on as every little space available is essential. This space is mainly used with extra bed lining, extra pillows and additional curtains of home. I have gathered all of them in one place and all that I could find throughout the house, anything extra which are scattered around here and there. Here is a vacuum storage bag. It's jumbo in size. I fill up all the extra pillows right to the bottom as the bottom is cube and it's widened once you place the things inside. I see there is still plenty of space available that I can fit in more. So let's keep everything in one place. Bed linings to extra cushions. When you know you cannot have guests around at least for some more time, it's better to pack them and keep them dust free. Indian lehengas are quite heavy, asking a lot of space and my western gowns are very long in length, taking away a lot of space. So here I am planning to use them to the length they are in. Let's see if it works. I am going to hook them up with these clippy hangers. This lehenga is extremely wide so I fold it up at the sides and then clip it with the hanger. I have four big heavy lehengas and one western gown. Here is another storage bag with a different style. Just perfect for hanging. Look at the size, it's massive. The patent hanger can be rotated for 360 degrees and hold up to 16 pounds. And the hanger has five rings from top to bottom. So you can hang at least five clothes and all of the clothes you place inside the bag does not overlap totally. You can identify clearly what clothes you place inside the bag outside the transparent vacuum bag. It has a wide open pocket that makes it all easy to fit in all kinds of clothing and the ones which I'm trying are definitely the most tedious clothing to handle. Well, I'm organizing this for my wardrobe but when I set to fly to India, I'm very much looking forward to carry these bags with me during the traveling to get all my shopping easily packed in my suitcase. These bags are just perfect if you are attending a wedding it not only looks after your clothing but also reduces the weight keeping it airtight, vacuum sealed and easy to zip up your bags. All the bedspreads, extra towels and curtains to go in this cubicle pack. I have only this much to store at home. What looked like needed a big house to store the extras now seems like I can easily manage in this house with the help of these bags. It also has this label section making it all easy to know where is what later in the days when we need them. I will leave a link of these amazing products in my description box and you can also find them on my Amazon page. Now that I have these bags ready, I am ready to airtight them using a vacuum to suction the air from the bags. Did you see the magic happen? I have saved 80% of the storage space making more space available for the rest of the things at home. No cap design and super airtight and watertight. Now for these heavy dresses and garments for them I do the suction but not completely leaving slightly air inside for the fabric. I'm just using my regular vacuum cleaner, what I have at home, to do this. Holding it up is a lot lighter now. The dresses now can be hung in its full length. 
so happy seeing everything fitting in so easily and still has plenty of space available. The number of things that have fitted in with the help of these storage bags is looking all neat and tidy. That has made my work more using another bag. These color changeable zipper when the bag opens the color of the zipper is black and white. It is so easily wide open that it makes it a lot easy to fit any garment. These kurta sets and sherpanis, I want to keep them intact for my husband who is hardly wearing them or using them these days. Protecting the clothes from dirt, dust and bugs. I seal this bag using this clip. When the bag gets sealed, the color turns into grey. I'm amazed with how it's working. There's still plenty of space in this little closet that I can fit in more. I use these lovely open baskets for keeping our daily wear of clothes. I have made it easy by just rolling them, easier to keeping it tidy and can spot the clothes easily and can lift it easily too without interfering with other clothing. And for his clothes, I just fold them basically with no special techniques used as I think in an everyday use this is something that I am very much used to. You can see most of his clothes are blue and green color. So I like to add in those lighter tones just here and there helping to differentiate. I just stack them in the basket. They look neat and easy to use for every day. One for him and one for me. Now let's pack those winter jackets for good at least for a couple of months. And trust me, when I say this, there were so many things that were hiding right underneath that we kept looking for until found today. Well, this is why one needs to clean to find those long lost things. Now that I have them, I need to allocate them their own space. Finally, this fellow is easing up and looks all happy. I used the hanging vacuum storage bag which holds up to 7 kilograms of weight and I thought the best way to get all these furry jackets tucked in. I keep them ready and I'm loving and enjoying getting these thick jackets away for some time and how easy is this process by just hooking in so easily even these thick jackets are now going to have a small volume. for leaving it to just 80% of the suction rather than completely 100%. How easily has it fitted in that little space available? You know how much I love using command hooks that I have used two big ones on this side of the wall and smaller command hooks on the other side of the wall in a zigzag point. Summer caps can easily be hanged on the rod using the space and then strapping. Now that I have found all my bandanas, I am going to keep them secured, all of them in one place. They just look so beautiful together. A few long scarves on a hanger as well. I have also gathered all my shawls and I'm using these cute little baby hangers that my baby has outgrown using them now. I thought I can use them for good. The back rod has still plenty of space that I thought I can easily hang all of them here. These are South Indian traditional lungis used during festivals and celebrations. I have folded them to a length that can be hung easily. 
I'm so glad using this space to the most and all these things having their own space from now on. Big summer hats on this side of the wall retaining the shape and winter hats on the other side. My masquerade mask has its space created now. I have these rose petals that I have dried at home and they smell lovely. I have added them in a pouch for natural closet fragrance. Christmas reindeer headband fits in perfectly too. Glass bangles are quite fragile. So I have decided to keep them separate on this door hanger which has been a wrong pick of size. But hey, everything has to be used for good. Can't just dump things, right? So I'm here using it for good in the closet for the glass bangles than going on the door. How colourful, how beautiful and so well organised is this closet now. That was totally unattended. I still have some more space that I am using these party bags to fit in our towels. Which I have ruled one for me and one for him. His and mine. The space is looking all good, all organised the best utilization of the little space that was available to the maximum. Now I'm done with all the organizing for today. These bags can also be used to stack toys, books, handbags to anything that you basically want. We have this large bag of soft balls that we fancy playing at home as a family. But don't really enjoy seeing this big bulky bag. So. Let's get into this suction bag. I thought of keeping this bag flat than in a cube shape. That was all easy and so light in weight. I'm actually enjoying playing around with these balls, getting them in and here's another lost treasure that I found today. Keeping it right underneath the bed and when we want, we can open the bag play the family game and the best of all, it's all covered from dust and dirt. I really need to treat myself with something quick and refreshing. So here are some watermelon slices in a pan. I add an olive oil and sizzle in these slices. until they caramelize on both the sides. I sprinkle in salt, chili flakes and chat masala and finally a few drops of lemon. I just need to sit down and enjoy it warm as a little treat to what I do. I am happy in using this closet and I hope you have enjoyed watching this video. Please consider subscribing to my channel if you haven't still. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye for now. No cap design and super airtight. You will save 80% storage space after the compression.